2022's iPhone SE, the chipset upgrade, 5G ready, affordable price and more. Here's everything that you need to know about the iPhone SE 2022. At the price point of $399, the 2020's iPhone SE became the Apple's best smartphone offering from a price perspective. Beating out several flagships in the pure performance comparisons, unfortunately there were some missing features that companies expected to address next year in the form of 2022's iPhone SE, while keeping some areas unchanged. The direct successor is reported to come with multiple upgrades at least on the inside, while keeping that competitive pricing intact. Well, here's everything that you need to know and let's start with the design. Unfortunately for those of you who are looking forward to a change in design of 2022's iPhone SE will sorely be disappointed. It has been reported that same iPhone 8 chases used for the 2020 version will be utilized to mass produce its successor. In terms of keeping the cost low, it is definitely an effective strategy not just for the Apple but also for its customers to get an opportunity to enter in the ecosystem without spending a great deal of money. Then again, some of those customers would have been greatly enticed in seeing a new design for a low-cost iPhone but on multiple occasions including this one, sacrifices are definitely to be made. As far as the display is concerned, according to Ming-Chi Ko and Ross Young, both are iPhone leakers, they said that the iPhone SE 3 will stick with a 4.7 inches panel that's an IPS LCD screen similar to its predecessor. It is likely the same display that we have seen in the iPhone 8 which again checks the cost saving strategy of Apple while it is disappointing that we will not likely see an OLED display with a high refresh rate on this smartphone. Fortunately the specification upgrade should be a reason enough for customers to pick it up. As far as the specs are concerned, this is the area that we consider to be the 2022's iPhone SE's biggest selling point. While the leaker Ming Chi Ku pointed out in an earlier report that we should expect chipset upgrade, he did not care to mention what exactly we'll be looking at. Well, considering the 2020's strategy of Apple, we'll not be surprised to see A14 Bionic to fuel up the iPhone SE 3. Not just this, but there are reports mentioning 5G modem being the part of the specification, with the iPhone 12 using Snapdragon X55 and iPhone 13 reported to use Snapdragon X6. We believe that the next generation iPhone SE will be using existing Snapdragon X55 definitely makes sense. For one thing, it is cheaper than Snapdragon's X65, secondly it features MM Wave and sub 6 GHz support. At peak performance, the 5G modem can achieve up to 7 GB per second download speed and 3 GB per second upload speed that is significantly higher than the speed on any existing 5G network that can deliver, even when connected to the MM Wave nodes. On the top of that, Snapdragon's X55 should be cheaper than Qualcomm's newer modems, therefore using an older modem makes sense for iPhone SE 3. As far as the cameras are concerned, while no concrete details are provided surrounding the iPhone SE's 3 camera, it will likely sport 12MP f1.8 rear camera with a 7MP front shooter just like the iPhone 8 and iPhone XR. While some might consider this a significant downgrade, keep in mind that the 2022's iPhone SE features A14 Bionic and its photography and video capture ability will go into the next gear. The image signal processor and the neural engine in the A14 Bionic offers a lot of software-based improvement as far as the pricing details are concerned, with Go stating that the iPhone SE 3 will be the most affordable 5G ready iPhone that the Apple has released, one can speculate several figures for its pricing. At the present, iPhone 12 mini is the most affordable 5G ready iPhone to purchase with a brand new unlocked model setting you back at $699 in the US. By existing parts to save manufacturing and research cost, it will not be surprising if Apple were to target 399 range for the 2022's iPhone SE, that is for the base storage model. Even if Apple were to charge 499 for the 64GB model, it would still be miles ahead of any competing brand in that price range. As far as the color and the release date of the iPhone SE 3 is concerned, a report from JP Morgan's supply chain analyst William Yang mentioned in a release, but no month or exact date was provided. We should assume Apple will proceed with a soft press release just like it did with the 2022's version 
As for the colors, the 2022 iPhone SE could arrive in white, black and product red finishes if Apple just wants to deliver an iterative update. Then again, the company could appeal the younger generation by including various flavors such as green, blue, purple like it did with the iPhone 12 lineup. However, we would be more excited to see a yellow finish added to the mix. And with that being said, I do really hope that you have enjoyed this video. If you really did, a like on the video and a sub to the channel would be highly incredible. Here's a deal signing off and I will see you in the next one. Till then, peace out.